Hi Jay. How are we doing today? How is everyone? Good morning, good morning. Hi Cal. How are we? How is everyone? Good morning. What does that mean? Sprite Cubanism. Sprite Cubanism. Kihayo, kihayo. I good? Good. Glad to hear it. I'm also well. Um. <laughs> I'm good, but kind of nervous. Why? Why are you nervous? What's going on? We do repairs, hello. Also, it says you have VTuber next to your name, Baja. Are you debuting soon? Always use floor seasoning. Se floor seasoning? Dust? What is that? Floor seasoning? Dust? Soap? Hmm? Today. Okay, um, we should be okay. Earlier I tweeted out that there is construction happening immediately outside of my window. Uh, but I think it's kind of calmed down. I don't know, they're supposed to be fixing like gutters or drainage pipes or something. So it shouldn't be too much hammering. I was concerned that it, <laughs> in the middle of us like listening to chill lo-fi beats that it would just go ga, 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 ga. <laughs> that's disturbing the vibes but i think we'll be okay use stuff on the floor as seasoning i am not understanding but that's okay but hello 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 welcome to spirit city lo-fi sessions um in this game, pretty much you, the whole point of this game is to be idle. It's an idle game, so there's not really much to do. The point is actually to kind of relax, lock in, so to speak, and just kind of allow time to pass, either if you're relaxing, studying, winding down for the night, um, I skipped over the tutorial part on accident, uh, so I'll, you'll just have to deal with me explaining the game for the most part. But this is it, so we have some music here, we have some options, um, we get to decorate our decor, our wardrobe, and then there's a spirit dex, and depending on where you wait in the room, and at what time of day, you collect spirits by waiting for them. So that's pretty much all we're gonna be doing today and just chatting. I played this, um, I played this during Next Fest when Steam was having Next Fest. They had this game out as a demo and I really liked the vibe, I really liked the feel of it. So I'm gonna kind of use it as like just chatting background. And we'll see how many spirits we can collect today. So yeah. Okay. Let's start with wardrobe. So we start with our appearance. I don't remember how I decorated myself last time. Very cool. Um, but I think I think this time you should also have more options for like clothing and stuff. Yeah, we do. Ooh, okay. All right, I can spend all day doing this huh <gasps> you can also select a custom color oh wait a minute no 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 <laughs> no wait 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 i don't want to be green that was for hair uh okay i am built like a stick so we're just gonna leave this how this is mm.
uh, I don't know. I think I'll just leave that. I'm more concerned about hair. Let's see. Oh, there are buns. Collect spirits, so both Ghostbusters while listening to lo-fi. Um, a very gentle way of doing that, I would say. Yeah, it's more like, it's more like you kind of camp out waiting for them. Like they need, they each need certain conditions in order to appear. And that is basically what we're trying to do. Also, is the music, is the music playing? Because, um, I thought I set it up, but I'm, I actually don't remember. <laughs> Cute. Yo, hi, Ilya. Interesting. Yeah, it's very chill. It is? Okay, perfect. Because I did, I did test it beforehand. Lo-fi beats to question metaphysics too. <laughs> Lo-fi beats to question every choice you've ever made too. Um, I can also, oh, I think I went with this before, but I think I'm going to go with it again. Oh, cool. Wait, I love how many options they have. Or the different kinds of options. Usually it's just like, long, short. You can go with quite a few. I like the buns. Buns. It's playing, it's playing. Okay, perfect. I can also change it, but I like the gradient, so I'm just gonna leave it. I'm just gonna leave it. Head feature. Horns. Yeah, tears. Don't you just put on your cat ears at night whenever you're relaxing? Don't you just love doing that? Hi, yeah. Hi, Leia. How are you today? Welcome. Boom, boom. Oh. Oh. Let me change the eyebrows too. Make them brown. You bleached your eyebrows, girl? Oh, wait, these are cute. Okay. Eyes. Oh, the eyes shape. I think I look pretty sleepy. Is there a sleepy look? <laughs> Not really. This looks pretty sleepy. I can never decide. Okay. No. Boom, 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 boom. These are cute. I love these. Facial hair. Ooh. Nice. Nice. Oh god, I've already started shrimping. Sit up. Sit up. Eepy. Good. That's the vibe we're going for. <laughs> oh, wow. Uncle Kiana. Okay. <laughs> I'm satisfied with this. All right, clothing. All oh, right, that's right, they have hats. Huh, confirm purchase. Whoa, wait a minute. Do I have currency already? Oh, I have 500 tickets. I see, I see. Oh. Oh. Okay, wait. Let's see what our other options are. So they have free options here for... But I like the buns. So maybe we just, we'll just deal with the bun. But the hat is cute. The hat is cute, though. Okay, what other things do they have that you... They might be like, ooh. bottoms are 100 as well okay so it looks like i can get a full fit so maybe i will try one of these hats and purple one oh there goes the hammering mm. yes cute i like it <gasps> yeah yeah this was a good choice Maybe I should have done the blue one, or maybe, no, I think that would have been too much blue, or the pink one. 
Tatiana with mustache looks too good. Thank you. Oh gosh, there's someone right outside my window. Should I close my window? Oh wow. There's like what are they what are they lowering? What is happening? Please don't crash into my window. Uh oh no, they're raising someone else. Honestly, people who work in construction with like scaffolding and things like that, I I hope they have insurance and are paid really well. Anyways, um Grandpa Key <laughs> back in my day. There it is. I'm waiting for that cool hammering sound effect. Uh, yeah, I, I hope I hope it doesn't get too. I'm really digging the needles in this hat. I think it's so cool. Okay, all right. Okay, glasses. Honestly, I should wear glasses. But I currently don't, so. I think last time he went with a shirt like this. Ooh, oversized hoodie. Oversized hoodie. My favorite. I've got some sweaters. <gasps> trans flag, I think. Non binary trans flag, maybe. Oh my god, raccoon. So cute. Bottoms. I am the kind of person who will purchase like an all white outfit and then get really upset when it gets dirty. Shorts. Comfy cozy. Hmm. Not yet. I kind of like these. I kind of like these. Boom, boom, boom. I wonder if there's a way to earn like more tickets or if you have to buy them. Back in my day, VTubers had style. Not this one. Dum, dum, dum. Can you buy socks too? You can. Oh, but I'm gonna wear long pants. I feel like it won't matter. All right, so we're gonna go with the loose fit. We're gonna go with the loose fit. I swear if one of these guys crash into my window, that's gonna be some content, boy. And a very expensive hospital bill. Wait, they're rolling away. How are they? Wait, how did they do that? What? Okay, well, whatever. All right, um, we're gonna spend all day here. I'm so sorry. Yeah, I wasn't interested in any of those, so I'm just gonna take a chance on one of these. Should I do another gradient or I want purple? Hmm. <gasps> There's a little thing on the bottom. Yes. Cute. Okay. Okay. All right. Last, last thing to pick. I like the. There's like a little mascot on the bottom. Character creation is peak content. All VTuber fans must agree. I can't help it. It's just. It's just so fun. I can buy some socks if I wanted to. Oh, but the pink ones. Black. Gray. Pink. Gray. Purple. These ones I won't be able to see because um, my pants are long. Okay. I think I think that's good. Spirit companion. Well, we only have one spirit, so okay. I guess that's that then. 
All right, the core. Wait, okay, so we didn't get to do this last time. Last time I didn't get to pick my decor, but this time I can. Green. Oh, they're all so soothing. My actual room, the color in my room, my walls are dark purple. And actually, when I moved in, they already were that. And at first I thought it was like a really weird choice. Like, why? Why? Who picked dark purple? But the, the more I looked at it, the more I liked it. And now I love it. And now everything that I bring into my room has to match my dark purple walls. And it feels very um, comforting. Oh, the brick. I kind of like the brick. Brick. Yee. No hint of green. Oh, and my outfit. Mm. Oops. <laughs> I mean, I think, I think the hair had a hint of green. If I took, if I kept my hat off, it probably would have. Main wall, side walls. Purple is a good color. It is a good color. It's a great color. It used to be my favorite color when I was a child. I was like, purple, purple, purple. Oh my God, oh my God. And then, but then, um, I don't know when it changed, but suddenly there was a switch in my head and I needed everything in my life to be pink. Um, and now I think... I'm starting to like green more. Surprise, surprise. I think not. I don't think it started that way. I think, uh, when did my image color start becoming green? I don't know. I don't know what did it. It is also my mother's favorite color though. She likes green. Okay, so let's make maybe the walls a kind of green. Can I move this? No, I can't. Because I want to see what my walls look like. My walls. Mm -hmm. The floor. Oh. Uh, I'm okay with just wood floor for now. Or maybe, maybe, well, okay, bed. Oh my god, you have to buy everything. Um, I, I want to see, I want to see what it looks like before I, I purchase it. Bay window. Mm, mm, well, I have 200 more tickets. So. The brown one, the brown one is nice. Green guy. What is like the most common favorite color? I wonder. I feel like it is blue. Oh, you can change the desk too. Wait, general. Wait, 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 wait. Side walls. Let's pick the different wall color. Okay, there actually are quite a few wall colors to pick from. Why? For some reason, I whenever it comes to decor specifically, I gravitate towards very dark colors. Why is that? Dun, 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 dun. Oh, you can change the chair. You can change everything. Uh, I didn't realize that this was so in-depth. I wonder how you get more tickets. Do I have to purchase them or... Or what? Small sidewall decor. Ooh. Wait, wait, what were my options for chair? Just the purple one? 
accessory cup. All oh, the cookies. Damen. I love that they have like the different flags. Ace flag. Woohoo. I did not know this was going to be this in depth. Could be. I had to refresh stream because loading. Oh, is it? Is it? Is it still? Is it having? Are we having problems? The main wall decor. There's so many options. Hmm. Chat, do you put a lot of thought and consideration into decorating your space? Katsudon. Oh, I love that they have like all the little gay flags in the back. they customize these based off of the skin color that you pick they must right books like color books you can have a wall of plants music ah it's so nice even just the option the free options that they have are really nice This one's pretty. Side of all decor. Okay, I do actually have quite a few plants in my room though, so maybe I should stick with the plant theme. I think when I was a child, um, I wanted to decorate my room a lot, but for some reason, when I was really young, I felt like I couldn't do that much. And then I couldn't really decorate it much in high school either. But then in college, I like put all these, I remember, I just remember ripping out a bunch of magazines from like J Fashion magazines that I really liked and just plastering them all in front of my wall. And I think even on my desk a little bit. Um, and I would just like collect a bunch of stationery and I'd put that all over my desk too. But I don't think it was with any intentionality. I just wanted to be surrounded by things that I liked. You know, I didn't even know we had a flag. We do, we do. And I think there's actually um, quite a few different variations on the ace flag as well, depending on exactly how you identify. There's a bunch. I remember seeing a YouTube video about it. Stream is skipping a ton, by the way, and having a, to load a lot. Mm, true mine too, okay. I wonder if it's because there are people on our roof. Let me see, let's take a look. It's not saying that, that I'm having any dropped frames let me check the stream health and see what's going on with that sorry friends i feel like it's always something maybe i need to close some stuff see if there are things that i can close um well let's see let's see mm, i see it now there are some dropped frames okay What do I have? I don't think I have much open. My stream stopped loading. five frames for a second oh my gosh um
Okay. Seemed like you were reading stuff a full couple of minutes. Okay. still dropping quite a few frames why I'm trying to lower stuff Okay, how are we doing right now? Are we doing a little better? Oh my gosh, why? What's going on? I'm sorry, chat. I'm trying to figure it out. Wow, that's quite the delay. Just heard that, but visually you're still skipping a bunch. Okay. Um... Hmm. fine scuff is normal the delay is really intense though uh hi remember me hi full how are you doing today trying to look things up to try <laughs> I just find it interesting because I feel like this is supposed to be like the most chill option for a stream like there's really not much in terms of graphics or anything it's just a game with music and it's just my model and for some reason we're still having huge issues hmm okay I'm gonna hope that that did something Okay, I don't know. I think we still might be going. See how bad the delay is. Um, can you chat? Can you type Kiwi into chat once you hear me say it? Stream connection is a bit scuffed at the moment. Apologies. I'd help troubleshoot, but I'm not at my. That's okay. That's okay. Kiwi. Okay, that's about a. 
10 second delay. Not terrible, but not great. Yeah, I don't really know what to do. Um, let me see. Kiwi, okay. <laughs> I think it's improving. I lowered the bitrate a ton. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping that that helps. I don't really know. Maybe there are like settings here that I can lower. Let's see. Graphics. Um... Let's, let's lower you down to 30. Uh, that's fine. Let's lower you down to this. Let's apply them. Yeah. Okay. Okay, that looks crazy, but like maybe, maybe it'll help. Skipping around stopped too. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay. Not skipping at the moment, so that's good. Okay, good, good. I haven't gotten a weird notification just yet, and OBS has not disconnected just yet, so maybe maybe we're okay. Maybe we're good to go. Tech wizard. <laughs> no. I press buttons, go beep boop, say chat that good, chat say no, not yet. I say okay. And I click around some more, I say chat that good, they say that good. I say okay, we continue. Pro streamer sugoi. Okay. Alright, let's hope that that stays that way. Um, alright. What was I doing? I was deciding on my decor. Thank you for being patient with me, I appreciate it. Um, let's see. Oh, I love fairy lights. I've always wanted fairy lights in my room, or they call them fairy lights. Actually, I never heard these referred to as fairy lights until I had like gone away to school and everyone was like, fairy lights, fairy lights. And I was like, what are you talking about? What does that mean? And they said, you know, the lights that you put on your Christmas tree, except when they're not on your Christmas tree, you call them fairy lights. L-O-L-T-Y. T.Y. <laughs> I kind of like the, I like the plants a lot. Nothing. Minimalist. Okay, let's go with this. And then I already decided to make wall decor. Boo -boo -boo -boo. I wonder what like the ideal feng shui is for studying okay let's go with this all right i did not know this you did not know this yes that is i don't know <laughs> that's what they called it um okay i think we're good Oop. Uh, general let's take a look at the whole situation okay there's pretty much accents of green everywhere surprise surprise and brick wall yeah this is probably similar to how i would actually have <laughs> my home set up <laughs> okay all right we have wardrobe set up everything is purple and green So, this is the spirit decks. Use the hints to find the hidden spirits. Different sounds, activities, and lighting will lure them out. Once the spirit decks icon is glowing, you're on the right track. Patience is key. It takes some time for them to appear. Okay, so this is where how we Oh, wait, this is a different spirit I think than was in the than was in the um the demo. So I'm excited to see which spirit we're gonna get. Hint, my desk has felt strangely clean lately. I may even be missing some supplies. All right, so I guess we have to wait around at the desk and then this one should appear. So let's do that. Do I need to get rid of things in order for it to work though? Or do I guess I just wait? 
now we wait. I wonder, is anyone actively studying in the background? What are you guys doing right now? Are you are you hanging out? Are you are you relaxing? Are you getting off work? Are you traveling? What are you doing? I think right before this, right before this, I was eating. Oh, hey, looks like we have our first spirit. Yay! Cute. Okay, who's this? Oh, wow. Okay, the, the effects are quite loud. I'm probably going to lower those a little bit. Goopy! Go to spirit decks. Have you ever thought to yourself that your desk is, looks a little cleaner even though you swore you didn't tidy it? You might have a goopy to thank for that. This gelatinous spirit travels across, across flat surfaces sucking up dust, crumbs, and loose objects to digest later. Despite their viscous appearance, goopies leave no residue, so many people welcome having one in place of a vacuum. Just be careful where you leave your stapler, because this ooze's diet does not discriminate. So he has a stapler in front inside of him. <laughs> so cute. Just watching and that's it. Lunch break at work. Nice. Well, Armand, welcome to the stream. Moving a bunch of furniture around from storage between my houses at the moment. Wow. Okay, that is like, wow. <laughs> That's some work you're doing there. Goopy. So cute. I think, I think I could probably use a goopy in my life. That sounds like an interesting concept. You just have like, like, it's essentially like what a sticky roller would do, but it's in gelatinous form like if i had something like that to just steamroll my desk it would probably pick up all of the cat hair that i currently have on my desk because my cat likes to walk across my desk and behind it when she wants something or like attention that'd probably be really nice my desk is pretty clean though i don't know yeah eat it eat it <laughs> what I don't know what flavor do you think it is it, probably, it looks like like a like a green apple maybe or like a melon practical which is familiar yeah a goopy not a cat or an owl but a goopy okay what's next in our spirit decks hint i've heard strange noises under my bed at night i wonder what it could be okay so it looks like we have to wait for the next one at our bed Quir. Go. Oh, wait, hold on. No, no. We go. <gasps> oh my god! You can pet your spirit. That's so cute. How do I go to different parts of the room? I don't remember how to do that. Do I go to decor? No, that's not right. How did I go to my desk before? I don't remember. What did I do? Wait. Toggle. You sign visibility, activity, lighting. Oh, bed. Okay. There we go. All right. So we just sit here, basically. And browse. And browse. And browse the internet. Green apple works. Aww. Need a goopy to pick up all of the hair on my floor for real. Honestly, yeah, pet, pet, pet owners unite. So I guess we earn tickets in order to buy stuff for our room as, as you play. Hmm, the spirit decks isn't rotating, so maybe it should be relaxing that I'm doing. Let's try this. What did it say? Under your bed at night. Oh, wait, maybe I have to change the time of day. Okay, at night. There we go. And then I can change what I'm doing to browsing if I want. Okay, I think that'll work. Honestly, if they sold a goopy, I think I might actually buy it. Like, it'd be like... What if, wait, that'd be really cool. You could like roll it around to pick up all the dust and then maybe it'd be washable, right? So you could like just run it under cold water and that would reactivate how sticky it is. I think that'd be really cool to have because then it's kind of like, it's kind of like, um, you know, those, those, those 
stretchy hands like the toys that you get from vending machines are like these long stretchy sticky hands and you would like and like one one side one side has like little holes so you can put your finger in it and the other side is a really sticky hand and you would just slap it all over the place do they still have those they have those a lot when i was a kid and that used to be a thing trending toys all of a sudden, all the kids had one. And you could, like stick to the ceiling. I definitely have a couple that just got stuck to the ceiling, and I couldn't get them down for months. Chat, do you know what I'm talking about? The sticky hands. <laughs> At first, I thought you'd be exercising them or something. Oh no, no, no! We're we're collecting, kind of like Pokemon. Yeah. <laughs> it's the exact opposite. We're not exercising anything. We're welcoming the spirits into our home. In fact. I know the ones where it has a cord thing to it. A cord. Yeah, like like a really long. Yeah, I think I think that's the same one. Like a like a retractable cord or just a very long. Yeah, the sticky hands used to get the Megach machines. Yes. And you like put like a quarter in it and you turn it and then out would come the sticky hand. They used to have them at um grocery stores. new spirit long rubber thing yeah yeah yeah. okay so we're, we are talking about the same thing yippee oh my god here's a button jesus christ that's so loud hold on um i don't think we need the sound effects to be at 100 percent okay dust bunny okay i think this was this one was in the um this one was in the demo yes those are fun but the stickiness goes away fast it does it does i know if there was a way that like every time you re-wet it then it became sticky again and the stickiness lasted longer i would definitely use that for my desk i would buy a goopy immediately Legend has it that dust bunnies emerge from the accumulation of dust balls nestled in forgotten corners. Yet, in my research, I found a more mundane truth. These tiny spirits have evolved to cloak their fur with the hues of dust camouflaging them from humans. Under the cover of the night, dust bunnies hunt for various bits and bobs that have been discarded around bedrooms, such as paper clips or buttons. They treasure their favorite trinkets, becoming quite possessive. Cute. Imagine you're like, I need that left sock dust bunny and dust bunny is like nyu, 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 nyu. I need it I need it mine mine <laughs> cute okay let's see who's next the past few mornings I've been awoken by a curious chirping noise I know for some of these you have to wait a little bit longer than others like i think it starts that it's it, they appear pretty quickly and then i think as you progress down the, the spirit decks you have to wait longer i'm gonna change up the music let's see they have different albums hmm lo-fi beats for spiritographers only chilling with the unknown Let's try chilling with the unknown. Rainy day incantations, web browser music. What's that? Oh, you can type stuff into YouTube too. Wow, that's cool. Spirit infusion. Let's try this one. I've always wanted a pet slime. Have you seen the campfire cooking in another world? He uses his slime to throw trash. It's very cute. Wait, no. I have no idea what that is. Campfire cooking in another world. What is that? Let's see. I'm gonna look it up. 
second fire cooking in another world. Oh, is this a game? Campfire cooking in another world with my absurd skill. This is an isekai? I've never even heard of this. This looks cute. A group of four Japanese citizens consisting of three high school students and one adult are magically summoned to a parallel uh, fantasy world by the kingdom of Reggie... Sager. Mm -hmm. Who asked them for help in their war against the demon folk. As a result the, of the summoning ritual, the three students appear to have several powerful magical abilities and are accepted as heroes. Okay, isekai stuff. This looks fun. Neat. Yeah, it's super wholesome. Mappa animated it too. The food looks awesome. Oh my god. It's on Crunchyroll? There are so many... Wait, when did this come out? 2022. Where was I? I feel like... You know, my recommendations on Crunchyroll must be messed up because I never get recommended really fun stuff like this. I feel like there are a lot of hidden gems on Crunchyroll that are, you, are really hard to like find because they're not as advertised as the really like big shows because I don't remember this one yeah it's super wholesome map it wait wait uh, it focuses more on a slow life he just going around feeding his big demon I love that I hate cringe roll <laughs> What do you watch your anime on, Jay, if anything? Or do you just have an ever-growing list, like me? Okay, so this next one is in the early morning. So let's change our activity to relaxing. And then change the lighting to morning. And wait. Right? That's what it said. I don't use Crunchyroll myself. I'm actually connected to my friend's account. Um, remember for a while I didn't have one and so then they said here is my user information, go nuts. And I, my life has never been the same since. The list just keeps growing. Whenever I watch anime, it's usually in a group watch along and I don't ask questions about where it's broadcasting from. <laughs> That's funny. Full view. This is right. Oh, they have sounds. Birds singing. Maybe it's this one. Smooth rain, cozy fireplace, brown noise, white noise. Ooh, that's nice. Nice friend. I really like this theme. Yeah, this one's nice. I don't know, I can't recommend this game enough. I'm pretty sure I will just be using it even when I'm not streaming just to chill. <laughs> and I think all of the, if I remember correctly, all of the music here is originally made for this game, Homework Radio. Maybe? I don't know. Maybe I'm making that up. Maybe I'm making that up. I did watch some of Eva at one point, but need to finish it. Eva? Is that a new one? I don't think I've heard of that. 
time to look it up. Let's see. Oh, Evangelion. Oh. I didn't realize that was a... Is that the one you're talking about? Evangelion? Because I haven't... I fam infamously have not seen that show. There are quite a few of the classics that I've never completely finished or haven't started. I feel like... Do you know how there um, can sometimes be like a really popular songs and that without ever adding it to your library or playlist, Spotify, whatever, it just plays so often and so prominently, you never felt the need to add it to your playlist and you know all of the words. I feel like, I feel like that's how some of like the top anime have ended up in my subconscious. Where I've never seen Evangelion, I haven't finished Naruto, I've never watched One Piece, but I feel like I know all the memes, all of the, all the references. I feel like I don't even need to watch the show because <laughs> I've seen so much about them that it's like, oh yeah, I've seen that. And meanwhile, I actually haven't seen it at all. I need to watch the movies. I watched it, but got lost halfway. <laughs> lost halfway meaning like, um, like you were confused, like it was going way over your head or lost, like you became disinterested. Ooh, there's some overlap there. Fair enough. I feel like I would sit down and watch it if I were with like like a group watch along. I'd probably watch it. Um, but to muster up the inspiration to watch it by myself does not exist currently. Yeah. Maybe that'll change, and one day I'll just be like, you know what? Life is short. I'm gonna watch everything. All the classics. I feel that way about reading. I used to really enjoy reading, specifically as a child. I'd read almost anything. I'd just see a book that had interesting art, and I'd pick it up. And I'd read it cover to cover, even if I didn't find it interesting. But now, today... <laughs> If things don't meet like very specific qualifications, I won't even give it a try. I'm like, nope. Yeah, I don't really like Shinji's character and it felt too slow at the time. Hmm. That's fair. I've seen some of One Piece since of Fred's dreams it on Discord and love what I've seen of it. Every single time I, that's the thing, right? Every single time I see a clip from One Piece, I'm like, wow, that looks really entertaining. And then I think about actually watching it and I go, nope. <laughs> I'm working at the moment, but this stream is too chill. I feel like I might accidentally doze off at some point. <laughs> Yes! That means I'm winning, I'm winning! Yeah, take a take a little a little nappy nap every once in a while, Blue. Maybe you need the extra rest. I think conceptually it's pretty interesting. I think I saw the other day... Um, okay, actually no. One Piece, I think, is one show I will never understand out of context. And I, I'm okay with that, because the clips are still funny. But I definitely did see... A clip floating on Twitter the other day and it was like one character was like really buff and had really shiny nipples and the other character was wearing like a diaper or something and it had like a pacifier and the caption said how are we going to explain to people who haven't seen this show that this is the manliest fight ever and I was like I have no idea what that means I don't know I don't know Jay it's super long, of course. Yeah, yeah, that's a bit of a deterrent for me, too. <laughs> Oop, there's a new spirit. Let's see, let's see what we got. <gasps> yes, yay, rise and shine, good morning. His head looks like a tortilla chip. Okay, go to spirit decks, let's go. Early burb, oh my god, early burb. 
When the sun rises, so do early birds. With their sunray-like feathers and positive demeanor, these birds thrive in the early hours of the morning. While not often seen by humans, you will likely hear their energetic chirps as soon as the sun rises above the horizon. In my research, I've noticed that some other spirits tend to avoid early burb. Perhaps not all spirits share their enthusiasm for the morning. I can relate. I find their upbeat nature and enthusiastic melodies quite invigorating. I haven't needed my morning coffee when it's around. Imagine a replacement for coffee? I personally can't imagine that. Oh, that reminds me, I need to order my tea. There's tea that I get that tastes like coffee but is not coffee and is herbal. And I think I really want that for like my afternoons when I want the taste of coffee but I don't need the caffeine. I don't know that character, the character that I'm talking about, the, the, the two. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I have no idea. I don't know what that's about. Yeah, I keep forgetting. I need to order it. I can finally order it, so I need to do that. Because it's, I don't know, the place that I try to get it from, it's always out of stock. So I need to check. Now I know tea coffee exists. Yes, it's so good. I think it's called like faux coffee or faux brew something like that f-a-u-x aka uh the one tea i will always recommend is genmai cha aka popcorn tea i remember you mentioning that to me i should do that we should have like a like a hand cam tea party at some point because i do have i have several little tea setups that could be nice we'll just do some tastings Probably like similar to this feel. That sounds great. Let's do it. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, I haven't showed chat my hands in a while. My desk. I keep trying to inspire myself to refurnish varnish. Revarnish my um my desk because there's so many like scratches on it and there's a spot where I got um, nail polish remover on it so I said this big this big bleach spot and I keep meaning to be like should I revarnish it should I enter my butch era and revarnish my desk um and I, I just I end up just like putting a placemat over it and calling it a day Virtual part tea party ikuzo. That sounds awesome. I've always wanted to get more into tea. Tea party sounds neat. Okay, I'm putting it on the list for doing it. I'm gonna get some tea orders in and we'll see. Well, let's see. We'll do a little tasting. It'll be cute. It'll be fun. I may have to try this popcorn tea at some point. It sounds really good. Like it sounds like it sounds like it probably has like a is it like a not a is it a <laughs> is it a like a black tea with like a long steeping time so that it's really strong and has like a like a burnt aftertaste? Or is it a um is it a like a herbal tea with just the specific kind of herbs just have like a very deep taste to them. It has popped rice in it. Oh, even better. Popped rice. Wait, no, that does sound amazing. Oh my god, now I'm just imagining if it has puffed rice in it and you add like a specific kind of sweetener, would that make it like caramel corn? That's exciting. I like this song, Oda Meadow, Blissed Out. This one's nice. You know when you're when you're shopping, chat, and then suddenly there's like a song that's playing, but it's been playing for about mm, two minutes and thirty seconds, close to three minutes, and you realize that you know what this is kind of a bop. And then you take out your phone and you're ready to shazam it, and then as soon as you do that, it's over. Top ten most painful moments about life, I think personally. I really should turn my auto shazam on. Um, Ari, my sibling, always has uh, their Shazam going on constantly in the background, so it's just picking up songs all day. I should do that. Who's next in our spirit decks? My room has been extra hot lately. I wonder if there's something up with my fireplace. 
Okay, so the next spot to rest is at the fireplace. Um, fireplace, fire. Oh, and then lighting. How do I turn the fire on? Oops, I think there's a way to turn the fire on. Oops, not that. Activity, lighting, mm, sounds, tasty sizzling. <laughs> okay, uh, ah, there we go. Cozy fireplace. Oh, you can turn up and down like how intense you want them to be too. That's so nice. You really can curate to exactly what you want. That's so cool. Okay, the birds singing. Don't need that right now. Just the cozy fireplace. I kind of want to take the hat off. Uh, do I want to take the hat off? No, I don't. No, I don't. Oh my god, that's genius. Genius. Honestly, I was like, wait, why haven't I been doing that? I've just been racing to my phone my entire life, like, <laughs> I gotta get the, get, get the bop, get the bop, get the beats, get the jams in. It's over. Oh, oh, reached new spiritographer rank. Nice, more spirit hints have been added to your spirit. Oh, wait, so as you continue, more spirits appear that you can, oh, I love this, I love this. Yes. Okay, that's actually really exciting for me. Because I was, I was concerned that eventually we would run out of spirits that we could get, but it says that there are more. Mm. I can add to my decor too. Look at all these points I have. Wait, this is so fun. Uh-oh, this is supposed to be a game that you can just have in the background, but it, I guess there's like a lot of, uh, if you just really enjoy, like, switching up decor and, 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 um, character customization, I don't know, I'm kinda digging it. Okay, let's switch things up a little bit. What should I do? What if I change the main wall? That's cute. Change the main wall. Let's see, I think that, like, the side walls should stay as exposed brick, but maybe like a deeper brick? Yeah, or a red one. One of these two. That's cozy, that's cozy. When there's something strange, in the neighborhood. Who are you gonna call? Lo-Fi Busters! Has anyone seen any of the newer Ghostbusters uh, franchise? I haven't seen any of it personally. Oh, this is so cool. Look at this wall. Wow. Wow. There's so many options. Oh man. So many options. This is so cozy. I really like this though. We're gonna stick with this. Okay, chair. Believe it or not, I've never seen a Ghostbusters movie fully. I believe it. <laughs> We just talked about how I haven't seen most, like, incredibly popular franchises. Oh, I believe it. Okay, I was kind of interested in the white chair. But what other colors? Oh, there's pink. Or I could do the brown one. Hee <laughs> hee. Nice and cozy. Mmm. Oh wait, I should have got this one instead. I can have them all. You see, red. Got a nice bright color. Do 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 do. Oh wait, now it's the exact same color as. Uh. Yeah. 
and desk. I can change the desk too. Hey, me too. I've only ever seen parts. A hey, partial watchers. Let's go. Partial watchers. Let's go. I feel like it's something I'm pretty sure I've seen the entire original, but I'm also pretty sure that I saw it when I was really young. Spending all my money on what? <laughs> and for what? Just cause? Just cause I want to? Just cause it's fun? I think I still like the purple chair the best. Oh, this is cute. view so many options looking good <gasps> let's see let's see who do we have cute oh I think this guy was in the demo too ah! going to spirit decks hedge log we have here. I've learned that these spirits are called hedgelogs, a solitary type of spirit that is drawn to extreme heat. Hedgelogs will wander until they find an active fire to nestle into, and then will settle there amongst the logs, excitedly waiting for their next chance to be lit aflame. Can you imagine? They're just like, please pick me, pick me. When's it my turn? When's it my turn? In fact, they are often not discovered until months or even years after they've taken up residence in someone's furnace or campfire, if they're ever even spotted at all. Hmm. Should I change the walls? Change the walls. Change the walls. Change the walls. Hmm, I think I like the brick. I like the brick. Brick! Oh, wait, go back. What were you before? Uh-oh. I don't remember. What were you before? <laughs> I think it was... Yeah, it was this one. And then sidewall. That's what it was. Okay, there we go. Lore. Chilling in the fire. <laughs> Chilling in the fire. That's an oxymoron. Okay. He he. Oh, increasing your spiritographer rank to reveal the hints for the spirit. How do you increase your spiritographer rank? How do you do that? I want to increase my spiritographer rank. Like, do I have to take pictures? Or is it just like by spending time in the game? Window mode. Is by spending money, sounds, music. I don't know. Knitting. <laughs> this is what happens when you skip the tutorial. Whoa. Uh. I must have missed it somewhere. My eyeball. Maybe it is by spending money. Wait, let's let's see. So 
back at the core. Um, mm, yum, mm, yum. Bay window. Okay, if I buy these curtains, does it go up? It does not. I wonder what that means. You can change the cushions. Oh, I see. Daily login, 100 experience points. Daily task done, daily timer done. Oh, we have to use the timer and also a task. Oh, ah, okay. I see. Interesting. Yeah, I guess that makes sense since this is meant to be a very like chill idle game, but that means we need to, we'll have to be playing this more. Okay, I'm probably just gonna mess around with... the decor now. <laughs> Got these... Ba -dum -bum -bum. I like the lighter ones. And then for cushions... Fireplace cushion. Rug. Boom, 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 ba dum, boom. Just picking random stuff. Okay, so let's see. To do. Add a new task. Timer. Hmm. Habits. My habits. Add a new habit. Should I use this for like work streams occasionally? A new journal entry. Oh. This is so cute! Is Noximor or whatever you said about my fire comment a Pokemon or something? Oxymoron. An oxymoron is when you put two subjects or two um, adjectives even in the same sentence that are the opposites of each other. Uh, for example, silent thunder would be an oxymoron because thunder, by definition, is extremely loud. But silent means very quiet, so that would be an oxymoron. So if you're chilling in the fire, right, chilling would technically mean, it means relaxing, but when something is chilling, it's also very cold. So to chill in fire, to me, would be an oxymoron. O-X-Y-M-O-R-O-N, oxymoron. I think that's how you spell that. Yes. I get it now. Yeah. Mm hmm okay, So apparently we have to add a task and a daily timer. Mm. I guess we can add a timer for anything. Wednesday. New habits. I feel like I would, I would write stuff down in this just for fun and then never actually do them. Making lists doesn't really seem to help me as much with getting things done. Hmm. 
Let's try it. Let's see. Let's add a timer. Oh, what? Okay. 15 minute sections with 15 minute breaks. This is a, uh, this is called like Pompadoro. I wonder, cause I know like for some people really getting into the flow takes a minute. Like I think for me, it takes about 15 to 30 minutes just to get into the workflow of something. So then stopping after 15 minutes once it's taken me that amount of time to get into my workflow feels a little counterintuitive but I guess maybe you could probably increase the time if it were like maybe for me I think about 45 minutes of working on something is a pretty good sweet spot before I take a break and then even then the break would be really short it'd probably be just me standing up stretching my legs getting a snack and then sitting back down BRB? Okay. But uh, yeah, there is a 15 minute timer going on right now. <laughs> Gotta head back to work. Have fun, Kiana. Thank you for the nice lunch time. Thank you for hanging out. I'm glad you enjoyed. Enjoy the rest of your day. Bye. Yeah. It's hard for me to know if like studying in this way would have helped me more in school because I was not a studier at all. Mm. I think the things that people would tell you, they'd say, you know, like make flashcards and then use those to study. I still remember the smell of the flashcards that we would use to learn new words as a child. It would be like ball, playground, um, apple, dog. And they had like a very specific, like plasticky factory finish smell to them. And I think I remember the smell of them more than I remember actually using them. Like the idea of using them seemed fun because they were all like shiny and new, but I don't think I ever actually really used them. Hmm. And now these days I don't have anything to study for, so I don't know if like making flashcards would act. Oh, I do remember making flashcards. Like we had to make them as a task in school. So I would we would make them for homework and then I wouldn't use them. Yeah. I was definitely one of the kind of students who would just kind of coast on class participation. Because <laughs> if I think about it as a student, I wasn't particularly on time. And I wasn't very good at studying for exams. So how did I pass school? I don't know. Oh well. <laughs> Speaking of which, well not speaking of which, but on a completely different topic, there are some chips behind me that I kind of want. Eh. Oh, I think the things that help me get through tasks throughout my day are probably snacks, snacks, music, mm. body doubling helps a lot. Remember sometimes, sometimes I will beg a friend to like <laughs> hop on either discord with me or a phone call or I'll call my mom and I'll be like mom I just need to I just need to get like a couple of tasks done can you just stay on the phone while I finish them because I really need to finish them and I can't concentrate and she's like okay how was your day I think things like that are really helpful for me not necessarily forcing myself to sit down so I guess in that in that in that sense study groups probably would have helped me. Hmm. Interesting. 
it's interesting i was i was this close to uh because the construction was happening outside of my window i was this close to being like hmm what if i what if i played what if i played persona 3 instead <laughs> It's been less than a week since I've gotten that game and I've already played it three times and I'm pretty sure I've already clocked at least 15 hours into the game, which is not hard to do actually, but it is still surprising that I've already done it to me. And I gotta say, I'm not supposed to stream tomorrow, but if you happen to wake up and see a waiting room for Persona 3, don't say anything. I'm gonna try not to though, I, I, have, I have other things that I'm supposed to be doing. Wait, maybe that's what I could, maybe that's what we can do. Wait, what's, what, how much? 125, it's 125 right now. <laughs> should I just use some of this, should I use some of this stream to like actually do some work in real time? That could be a good idea. Hmm. Win-win. And then I can use the... And then we'll get our, our, our points so that I can open unlock new spirits in the spirit decks. I back. Sure thing. LOL. <laughs> Chips. Welcome back. Okay. What should I name this task? Um. seven minutes let's see how how long it actually takes me to get into the groove of doing whatever this is okay i can close the habits i don't need that skip current timer Do. Oh, that was also. Oh, yeah, to do. Journal. All right, let's see. Um, where are they? Oh, here they are. <laughs> oh, wow. I haven't opened this in weeks. currently doing a task.
nice. Okay. Why is all of this open? Kind of want more coffee. All right, chat, I'll be right back. I'm gonna grab some coffee. How many more seconds are on the timer? I wanna make sure it doesn't go off. Four minutes left? Okay, BRB. A simple idea where neither of my cats are, and that's very suspicious. Yeah, I'm back. This one. I'm not used to working on things through it during the day. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, they're they're suspiciously quiet. I don't know what that's about. I'm mean, very used to working on things at night. Um and I think I can also usually see the colors a little bit better, but I guess it's okay. learn something new every day.
15 minutes are over. What? Wait, how do I know? This is with five minutes break, five minute breaks. Does it automatically do the five minutes? New spiritographer rank, yippee! Nice. Who gets added though? Let's find out. <gasps> There's two more. Okay, I'm gonna set up to find this next spirit and then I'm gonna restart the timer again and see how much work I can get done while sitting down. <laughs> Hint, as the light gets low, I seem to keep stepping on bits of loose knitting yarn scattered about as the light gets low. So I guess we should be knitting. That looks like a boog. Um, let's try evening and then activity. Hmm. Bay window knitting. Let's try this. Okay, let's start. Fresh 15 minutes and then five minute breaks. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. It'd be thundering outside. Is it thundering right now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven. Oh my god. like thundering and also raining or is it like just thunder sometimes it's really interesting just hearing thunder from like miles away I used to live near a river and it'd be really interesting like hearing on like the just the opposite side of the river hearing all of the thunder and like seeing lightning and looking outside of my window Maybe it's just um, a storm that's passing by. Oh, is this not? Uh... That's too small. Enjoy the sounds of rain and thunder. Could be a storm passing by, yeah. Hmm. I wonder if I like because there are also there are also storm sounds here too. Oh wait, I want to get rid of my hat. What? No. Um, 
Yeah. Well. Is a storm over there now? Um, there's no storm here. There's just... It's very, very cloudy though. I can't see the sun at all. It's a bit of an overcast. Actually, I don't know if it's supposed to rain daily. Let me check the weather. Hmm. No rain today, but there might be some rain tomorrow. So... Should be in the clear. Maybe the rain is, uh... And then we didn't have any rain yesterday either. Maybe the rain is, is coming from wherever you are and it's heading over to me. <laughs> I think there was a period of time, I think, when um, I was having a hard time sleeping and I used to turn on rain sounds because they were peaceful. But I felt like even though they were peaceful, it did help me relax, but I felt like I still couldn't fall asleep. Because I was like, it's relaxing, but it's still noisy. I don't know if I prefer sleeping with a uh, white noise or if I prefer sleeping in complete silence. Because I feel like even when it's like silent, the silence fills your ears. Do you know what I mean? How you spell this word? I'm like, it's too quiet, I think. Understandable, I think. It's okay if it doesn't make any sense. I think that's how you spell that? Yeah. I don't think... Then again, it's- I think it's rare that I've had sleeping issues or what I interpret it as sleeping issues there was a period of time where I wasn't getting enough sleep but it, it wasn't because I was anxious I just wasn't sleeping I don't know like I would just go to sleep very late and wake up very early it wasn't that I would like lay down at a recent sleeping hour and then be up I just didn't realize that humans were supposed to sleep more <laughs> well gotta get off since stream starts soon and really enjoyed your stream enjoy Baha. good luck have fun what are you streaming today wait what hmm thank you and bye bye I think, I think I should just... Mm. 
Whoa. Oops. My introduction stream. Oh my gosh, good luck! You got this! I remember for the longest time you were said you were nervous to start. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you. I hope this stream got you into the right mindset to start. all my business what are we doing we are trying out i am trying actually <laughs> using this app to do some work in real time because part of the way that you increase um your spirit your spirit what is it my spirit something my spiritography level is by actually using the app the way it's supposed to be used app wow the game the way it's supposed to be used um so i'm using the timer and i'm actually working on an actual task <laughs> in real time so we're, we're still just hanging out we're still just chilling and i'm i'm also playing with the different uh sounds that you can choose from because it feels nice in my ears Spiritographer, yeah, that's what it is. Uplifting. I think I already did that one. Yeah. And now we're working on getting another spirit, but I think some of them take a little bit longer than others. Which is good, because the pace of this is supposed to be really slow. So just a little bit of working with some chatting in between at this point. Which is good, because I've needed to get these done for a while. <laughs> Oops. Because I think I was talking about earlier how um, the idea of sitting down and force myself to sit down and focus on something for 15 minutes is not really uh, feasible for me. It really helps if I either have like snacks or music and then it takes a little bit longer for me to get into the groove of actually doing something, more like 15 to 30 minutes, so to stop at the 15 minute mark doesn't really make sense. But then also like working alongside like either a friend or if I have my, my mother on the phone or like a Discord call or something that also helps me to stay focused. What is it like 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 active studying? Active working? I don't know what it's called. But that seems to work a little bit better for me. But I really do like this this game um fills up the the, the music and stimulating sounds aspects that helps me to focus. So that's good. <laughs> Ilya, have you have you walked your dog yet? Has your dog gotten walked? You it's you with the dog, right? I believe so. 
I'm pretty sure a couple of times whenever I started stream, you've been like, walk in the dog, BRB. I wonder if Jay's done moving his furniture. guitar. I think usually whenever I'm working, um, as opposed to actually using, like, oh, 15 minutes. Yeah, see, and now I'm just starting to really get into the workflow. So 15 minutes is too short for me. I wonder if I can lengthen it to, um, longer than that. Oh, you can. Oh, wow. Oh. What is this? This is the... That's kind of nice. I'll probably leave it as... Should I leave this 15? I don't know. I get it, I have attention issues too. Just go back, just got back from walk. Yes, yay! Walkies. What kind of dog do you have? We've got a new spirit. What the heck? Ooh, oh, ew. Ah! Okay, I don't really like spiders that much, but um, this one's kind of cute. Spirit Dex, <laughs> a rack knit. <laughs> okay, the name is cute though. In Spirit City, finding a web spun of yarn in your attic means that you're sharing your home with an arachnid. These crochet cuties are drawn to homes that are full of creativity. If you're lucky enough to attract one, you'll want to do everything you can to keep it around. They spin beautiful threads of endless yarn to entice smaller spirits into their webs. Don't worry. Once they've knitted them a toasty sweater, they send the small spirit on its way. That's cute! Be like... Yes, yes, come to me so I can knit you a sweater. So scary, so frightening. <laughs> Having a rack knit as a pal means you'll never run out of knitting supplies. Oh, I think we can also change our companion. So right now our companion is Lenny, but maybe I should change it to like Dust Bunny or Goopy or something. Wait, let's do that. Wardrobe can change the spirit companion to Goopy. Yay. And now that's who's chilling with us. Cute. Okay, who's next? Hint, whenever I'm reading, I feel the presence of something over my shoulder. So I need to read in order to fulfill this one. Where should I read? A black lab girl. Oh my gosh, I love labs. So friendly. And a black one. I don't see black Labradors very often. Hmm. Black lab. Happy, happy. Happy dog. Okay, let's go right here. And oh, this. There's no. Okay, I can't read over here. Can. Oh, there we go. I can read by the bay, though. All right, let's do that. And let's start a timer. Eh, you know what? Let's leave it at 15. I think. Yes. Black lab. Okay. Oh wait, I think that's all of them. Hmm, 
Not bad. Uh. Hmm. I don't really know what to add to this. chat i will return once again i will be right back I'm back. BGM is too good. I know, right? Honestly, whoever was in charge of the soundtrack. Chef's kiss. I'm a fan. Where are they getting their um, credits are here. Music provided by Homework Radio. So Homework Radio did an incredible job with the, the BGM for this. Welcome back, welcome back. Doritos. I think I'm getting actually hungry. I don't know what I'm gonna have for lunch. Welcome back, welcome back. And while we're here, um,
Yeah, maybe? me a saxophone. this song a lot. Mooj. Oh. This reminds me of, um, mm, my grandma when I was younger. One thing that I always remember about her house is that there was always jazz music playing. saxophone was featured heavily it was like CD 101.9 like it was like very very chill I think that always stuck with me because then I think all throughout my life I've always looked for jazz music to play as like my relaxing music of choice so lonely at 2 a.m. in the morning here, but I'm glad I woke to Kiana streaming. Aww. But yeah, let's hang out for a little bit together. Okay. I think I just have to get some of the finishing touches on here. pretty much finished the task that took me forever to do yay which means I get to tick this off Oops. reach new spiritographer rank six I wonder how many ranks there are Maybe. yay thank you thank you Everybody clap. <laughs> uh. Something about the seasons changing always makes me think, wow, it's time for me to start I don't know, like, like making or cooking um, season appropriate dishes. Like it's spring, right? So I feel like I want something really refreshing, like, like a noodle salad with chicken or. Hmm. Something like that, or maybe, <laughs> yay, a little, little, 
emoji. Or um, what else is really good? Like in the springtime. Hmm. Something like that you can enjoy outside, but not quite summery, because summery is like barbecue. But winter also sometimes feels like barbecue. But definitely like a cold noodle dish, even though I know that's more of a summer thing. For some reason, the very first couple of days when it starts getting warmer, I'm like, I need, I gotta go out. I gotta eat, I gotta hang out with friends. The sun is back, the sun is back, everyone. Rejoice, like yesterday. Um, I'm more, I'm definitely enjoy wearing like crop tops. So I wore a crop top sweater, but I also had a jacket, but like maybe like five um, blocks in. It was so hot, I had to take it off. Phew. Okay, I think I'm gonna wait for this last spirit to... Because this is the last one we can get, I think, for today. That's kind of cool, though, because then you only have, like, a certain amount of spirits that you can get when you've completed, like, daily tasks. Earn XP every minute and by discovering new spirits. Because then that means you'll technically only be spending a certain amount of time on this game at a time and then uh, on this game at a time each day. And then after that, you wait until the following day. Then you like raise it again. Is there more hammering going on? I feel like I hear hammering going on. Maybe it's just me. Sometimes I hear stuff and then chat's like, I don't hear anything. I wish I could give the spirits nicknames, kind of like you can for Pokemon. Can you? No, it doesn't look like I can. That's okay. <laughs> Yeah, spring is tricky. It's tricky. I know, I don't know how to dress for spring because it's like too hot to wear a jacket. And I don't, I've never, I don't think I've ever, okay, you don't really hear the hammer. Well, that's great news actually. So that's good. I hear it. It sounds like it's so loud. I can feel it in my feet too. Um, I've, I've yet to achieve the perfect spring jacket, like like a jacket that actually feels like it is made specifically for spring. I feel like any jacket that I wear that is technically called a spring jacket is either too light or it's too heavy. I am in pursuit. I feel like it would be made of some sort of jean material. Leather's too heavy. I've discovered leather is too heavy. We'll see if I can achieve that this time. Oh, new spirit. Okay, who's it gonna be this time? <gasps> oh my god, it's a caterpillar with glasses. Oh, it's so cute, help. Chapter pillar. Mm, I love that, I love that so much. Are you a librarian? Okay, chapter pillars are some of the best companions you could ever want for all those cozy sessions curling up with a good book. That's because their antennae glow with a gentle light that is perfect for illuminating the text even in the darkest nights and thunderstorms. Just be warmed. Because they are voracious and impatient readers themselves, they have a pesky habit of nudging people's hands to turn to the next page even if you're not caught up yet. So cute! I remember those days of like reading a book underneath my, my um, it was very hackneyed, this is very like cliche, but I would, I would read a book at night under my covers with a flashlight as if my mother couldn't see that I was reading if if she were to pass by my room but she would just leave us be because and I do this because there were three of us and um 
at the time when I was when I was growing up, the Harry Potter book series was extremely popular. And it was to the point where like you would go to school, you would go to class and every single kid in our classroom would be reading like one of them. Um, but instead of buying a copy for each of us, because we would read through them so quickly, my mom would only get us one copy and each of us would have one week at a time to read it. You could read as much as you wanted, but you would only have a week and then you would pass it on to the next sibling and then you'd have to wait until it was your turn again. I was very impatient, so I would, uh, and, and like our other siblings would get mad when I would do this because my week would be over and it would be the next sibling's turn. And so at night, when I thought everyone was asleep, I would pick up the book and I would sneak it underneath my, my, my covers and I would read it with a flashlight. <laughs> And I remember one time I got up what I thought was like extra early so I could get some like extra reading in and I just finished it and I was like yeah I finished it and I was ready to put it back into the bookshelf and Ari caught me and was really mad I was like I can't believe I can't believe you took the book when it was my week <laughs> got me a spring jacket but it's too warm after all right Ilya the pain the pain for when the winter is finally over and you're like it's time for this spring jacket but if you wear it and it's like still too cold like 40s 50s you're like oh it's still it's still a little bit too cold and then finally the perfect time arrives and you're like this is spring jacket weather and then you put it on and you walk outside and you walk two blocks and it's too hot and you have to take it off. The only time that it actually makes sense for me to wear a spring jacket ends up being in like the subway, like, like, cause uh, the, it's always air conditioned, but then I'm inside. Why am I wearing a jacket when I'm inside? I should be wearing a jacket when I'm outside. Or if I go to like a really cold supermarket, then I can wear it without, without being too hot. But then again, I'm indoors. Oh, same, you were really hyped about HP. Oh yes. I'm pretty sure I grew up with the characters as like like when they were nine I was nine when they were ten I was ten or like around the same age so I was like oh my god except no they're slightly older than me technically canonically but yeah growing up growing up I was I was absolutely a Potterhead was very excited throughout my childhood for sure no not so much but <laughs> Definitely as a child that was like, like the magic, and then that, that was the thing too, because I was a kid, like the magic just felt, the magic about it felt so real, because your imagination is really wild as a kid, so you're like, I too will be waiting for my, my Hogwarts letter to come in, maybe, you know, <laughs> but yeah, at least you finished it before you got caught, <laughs> except I did get caught <laughs> one time, I got caught one time. But yeah. It was that, and then there was another book series that I really liked, um, and it was called The Circle of Magic, and I remember it was a book series that I found in my junior high school library, because I didn't like going outside um, and playing with the other kids. I wasn't really like an outside play kid, I was an inside hangout kid, so there was a group, a friend group that we had. There was a friend group that we had. Um, and we would just go to the library and read. They would have like manga, <laughs> like a, like a really, it was a really tiny, like rolly cart, a very small selection of manga. And I think they had like, oh my goddess, Inuyasha. I think that's when I discovered Inuyasha and became like really into it. Uh, Planet Ladder, which is a book series that I collected. Um, and then to the left, after I finished all of those, was a book called the circle of magic and i just remember one of the characters doja doha do I, I don't remember exactly how she pronounced her name but she was a black magician and i was like oh my god it's a black girl a black girl wait that's crazy because i hadn't seen that before because there was like at the time what was popular was i think he was like harry potter percy jackson um there was a one that was had to do with dragons what was it or, or it would be like like woodland creatures like red wall but i hadn't seen like a black girl magician and so but this series had one they had a black girl and they also had a black boy and i could never pronounce any of their names because they were all like mystical magical names but i remember being really excited and so i like read like two or three books out of that series but yeah i was definitely like like ooh, i like magic and stuff when i was a kid 
fell apart her at oh two they start at 11 no i don't remember whatever whatever age they were yeah 11. actually yeah that makes sense because first years were 11 second years were 12. that makes sense that nope you're totally right <laughs> you're totally right wow circle of matt wait wait do they still let me see is that what they, was that what it was called circle of magic by tamora pierce yes yes oh my god sandry's book and they each like had a different element that they could control and i think the black girl could control fire i think it was fire that she could control wait what was it oh wow briar yeah i got like halfway through briar i got through sandry's book um tris i think i read tris as well where is the girl Oh, Daja. Yes, Daja. I thought she was so cool. She was like riding a horse and she had armor. It was really cool. I really like Daja. Yeah. Chapter Pillar. Oh, Chapter Pillar, do you want to be my companion? Go back to wardrobe, spirit companion. Chapter Pillar. <gasps> uh, wait, hold on. Get get all the, the UI out of the way. Uh, how do I move it? Oh, F1. Wait, I'm like done with this. There it is. Oh, it's reading a book. So cute. Yay. The BGM is slowly pulling me into the dream world. Yeah. I know it's kind of funny watching some of you guys like, oh, he's dressing his glasses. Kind of like trail off and then be like, what, what happened? I was asleep. What's going on? so cute it's so cute i love him chapter pillar to the rescue Spew! Spew! <laughs> whoa what happened to me why why am i different oh is that also my t wait why am i <laughs> why am i different oh i guess my hotkey is also f1 mm. i should change that Keanu with no bones. <laughs> you look gorgeous. Yeah, with, with all the text going across my face. I should change it then from F1 to something else. I think I initially changed it to F1 because I was like, when am I ever going to press that during a stream accidentally? Whoops. Now look. <laughs> okay, um... Okay, I think I'm gonna call it here for today. Um, but thank you everyone for hanging out. I... cannot tell you how much I enjoy this game spirit city lo-fi spirits looks like we'll have to wait another day in order to level up on our spiritographer level but this is this is really fun i guess i can mess more with, with the decor but that'll be endless Poor fellow Kiwi, Sizzle would have died on the spot if he saw you with that hairstyle. I've been pretty sure I've gone through um, the many different options that you can do in 
um, for the Mochan model before. We can tell how much you like it, lol. Hee <laughs> hee haha, thanks for the stream. <laughs> I like it a lot. It makes me happy. Not as much as P3, though. <laughs> At any moment when I'm home, I'm like, man, I need a break. What if I just turned on P3 right now? <laughs> um, are we streaming tomorrow? Let me check. I don't think so. I've been feeling pretty chaotic, though. Who knows? Okay, tomorrow technically we're supposed to be off. Whoa. Why does my schedule look like that? Why is the text... Okay, that's fine. That's alright. Um, so tomorrow technically is off, so if you see anything, just know that it's completely unplanned. And... <laughs> I've just... I've been in a very, uh, creative mood lately so i've just felt like streaming more um this will not always be the case <laughs> you will not always just see me randomly going live uh but lately i've just felt like interacting and chatting and creating a lot more so if you happen to see me suddenly go live don't feel pressured to jump in and chat you don't have to um, also, don't feel bad if you miss streams. I know I've gotten some messages from some of you saying, like, I'm sorry, I keep missing the streams. Like, it's okay. It's okay. The whole point of streaming multiple days a week is so that you can find one that suits the theme and the time that fits you best. It's all optional. I really appreciate you all just for being here. Um, so never, don't ever feel bad if you see me streaming. Uh, more often than I'm supposed to, or if you miss streams, it's totally fine. We also had fun, the great BGM plus the hammer sound effects, which I think they pretty much stopped all at this point. And then there's also, there's also always VODs. I appreciate VOD gang, I appreciate lurkers, you know. I'm here for you, I'm here to um, help fill your time, whether if that's at 2 a.m., or if that's while you're working, or if that's during your lunch break, or whatever, you know? So don't ever feel pressured to make it to every single stream. That's not what this is about. Anyways, I just wanted to say that, but uh, appreciate you all. Thanks for today. Had some, have some good rest. Otsukiana, have a heart. Otsukiana, Otsukiana. Yes, thank you. So tomorrow anything that happens will be completely unplanned do not feel obligated to jump in but our next planned stream is friday and we're playing finally playing the stardew valley update with blue our very own resident blue alpaca goddess queen genshin gacha gamer um artist extraordinaire we'll be trying out the new update finally finally yippee yay Yay, farming! Woohoo! Yes. I'm looking forward to seeing. I haven't seen any of the any anyone streaming the new update, so I actually have no idea what's gonna happen or why it is that they recommend you do it with co-op, but I'm very excited to do some farming. Let's go. Same time, same place here on Friday, 12 p.m. EST, 4 p.m. GMT. So lock yourselves in. And I'll see you there. Bye bye. Thanks for the stream, Kiana. Looking forward to it. Otsukiana, Otsukiana. Oh, I, and I cannot forget. I need to put key stars in the Discord. If you are not a part of our Discord yet, there's a link in the description. Um, I hang out there all the time. I'm very responsive there. And for each stream, I've started awarding key stars, one key star per stream. In addition to like getting points for dad jokes, you can also get points just by hanging out. So no pressure, but if you want to hang out more, you can there. 
Me too, going blind. Let's go. What? <laughs> Spread Kiwinism, spread Kiwinism. Yes, let it spread. Blah. Convert your friends. <laughs> All right, I'm actually heading out of here. Bye. Thank you so much for hanging out today. Thank you, Reiko. Thank you, Ilya. Thank you, Blue. Thank you, Leia. Mm hmm. Who else is here today? Thank you, Jay. Thank you, Baja. Hope you're enjoying your stream. Uh, thank you, Armand. I think that was the first time I've seen you chat here today. Um, also, sometimes you guys have different usernames on YouTube than you do in Discord, so if I ever happen to miss you, please let me know. Who else is here? I think I got everyone. Oh, and Kel, of course. Thank you, Kel. All right. I'll see you guys later. Have a enjoy the rest of your day, night, evening, work, whatever. I'll see you later. Bye, my Kiwis. Bye.